MMOD stands for micrometeoroids and orbital debris. Um, they are two different sources that produce the same threat. The threat is impact with an object that's traveling several kilometers per second. Uh, micrometeoroids are the, the natural, naturally occurring um, objects. They come mostly from, uh, from asteroids or comets. And orbital debris is the man-made man -made stuff. And orbital debris includes uh, whole spacecraft that aren't working any longer or spent rocket stages down to um, paint flecks or very, very small items. That's all considered orbital debris. And depending on the size and the velocity, it will uh, produce different, different risks and different damage when it hits spacecraft. So the, the, the risk from MMOD is that a particle will hit uh, your spacecraft and, and either cause damage that would affect the mission of the spacecraft or, or even lose the spacecraft in, in some instances. So that, that's the, the general risk of MMOD and why we, why we care about it. The first inkling that man-made debris was, a, was going to be an issue was back in the Gemini program. When the Gemini capsules would come back, they would analyze them for, for, for damage. And, and they knew that there were micrometeoroids out there. Um, but by looking at the, uh, the impact, the craters from the impact damage, they were able to, to find out, well, there's some man-made stuff up there also. And as we explored space more and more through the Apollo program, uh, and through the shuttle program, we learned more about the, um, the effect that orbital debris had and how it was growing. As more satellites are put up into space, it, there's more opportunity to create more or orbital debris. And, and we've seen that. We've seen the, the population of orbital debris growing. And in most of the orbits, the orbital debris is more of a concern now than the micrometeoroids, just because there's, there's more of it. The micrometeoroids tend to go at a higher velocity, but the, the just amount of orbital debris is, is much more. So that, that really is the higher risk factor now, is impact from, from all these, these pieces of, of spacecraft that are, that are floating out there.